Hello kids, all are welcome to APICT Panthia YouTube channel. So, today we are doing grade 6 ICT lesson 6 using the internet for collecting information and communication. So, this is the third video related to this lesson. In the previous videos, we discussed about uh, what is internet and what are the uses of the internet and then what are the things we need to connect it to internet uh, so we will uh, discuss about web browsers and finally we discuss about search engines so in this lesson we are going to learn about tips to make our search more efficient so how we do our searching so there are some tips you can follow to get the more results api puthe me paadame thi ikana ganne api search karaddi ikana ganna puluwan podi podi ingi gana me ingi paavichi kala me shortcuts methods paavichi karala apita lazy em apita hoyanna one de pahasu wen lazy em hoya ganna puluwan so let's move the first tip is use keyword do not use complete sentences or questions okay. when you are search something don't do not use complete sentences or questions there is a simple example you need to find about history of the sri lanka then you type i need to find the history of sri lanka so it is wrong you should search as history of sri lanka just use keyword avashyama devitara pavichi karan history of sri lanka right next one removing unnecessary word do not use words that are not relevant to your search oya search karne kada adala no wanna kisima vachanayak bavitha karanne paputi do not use Words like how and what in to as don't don't do not use any supportive words. Kisim supportive word ja use kara nipa. So you want to know how to make a cake. So don't type as how to make a cake. Just type make a cake. So, next tip is if you want to use many words. It's better to include them within a inverted comma. If you want to use many words in your search, it's better to use inverted comma. I want to search about historical places in Sri Lanka. So I want to include it within inverted commas. So our search will be more efficient. Right? Next one. When you want to use more than one main word, connect the word with the plus mark. For example, when you need to see the beautiful places in candy, so there are two main words, candy and the beautiful places. You can connect these two main words, two main points using plus mark. Candy plus beautiful places yes. when you look in only for an image then you can click the image button you are only looking for a map or a videos then you can click only video or maps okay let's do this practically right uh, i'm opening microsoft edge web browser in the address bar, I am typing a web address related to a search engine. I am typing Google web address. Right? And click it. Now I am in a Google search engine. So, let's follow some tips to search more efficiently. Yes. First tip, do not use uh, questions or a sentence. So, I just want to search about mammals. So, I 
type as mammals. Right, I got many hyperlinks related to mammals. In the second one, second tip is not to use how and many as to like supportive word. So I want to know how to prepare a paper flower. So I'm typing here instead of how to to make paper flowers just I type as paper flowers then I will get more images videos related to paper flowers right how to make a paper flower like this there are many more hyperlinks okay next tip okay when you want to in your search it contains many words in that situation you can include your search word search in sentence or search in words within inverted comma so i want to search about his places in Sri Lanka I put it within inverted commas right so my search is more efficient and I got many hyperlinks related to my search here in the next tip in your search if it contain more than one main word we can use plus mark to connect these words right I want to search about beautiful places in Mathara. So, Mathara plus plus beautiful places. Then you can search it very easily okay if you want to get only images then you can click the image button right then you see only the images there are many more right okay these are the tips you can follow when you do your searching so then your search will more efficient and this is the end of this video in the next video we will discuss about how to use the internet safely then what are the methods that you can use to do internet safely so let's meet with the next video until then goodbye all of you